Popular summer spot in Saline County, also apparently a popular place for people who want to dump their trash. The county is now asking for volunteers to help clean it up before several inches of rain falls in the area, and then the trash is then just washed downstream. Stephanie Sharp shows us how Recycle Saline hopes to fix the problem. Trash and litter are everywhere at 10 Mile Creek Public Use Area. Recycle Saline is hoping to get a group together to clean this up before a potential of flash flooding in the next couple of days. Clear water flows down the 10 Mile Creek in Saline County. This area is filled with families to enjoy a place to cool off in the summer, but there has quickly become a problem. A lot of litter. Is left behind. Tiffany Dunn of the Recycle Saline Executive Director says over time more and more people have left their trash, some burning their trash, both illegal. If there's not trash cans around, save it and you know dispose of it for whenever you can. They are working to clean up the trash before Hurricane Laura moves through the natural state, causing a potential of flash flooding. That 10 Mile Creek is a large riverbed, and with all this rain that we're expecting tomorrow and tomorrow afternoon. It could have a great possibility of washing all that litter down into the creek and which will also run it down into the Saleem River. Their goal is to pick up the litter before the rain comes so all of this isn't washed downstream, causing more environmental problems. It's going to run into the, I want to say, the south fork of the Saleem River. And then from there, there's no, many, no, no telling how many animals it's going to come across. The biggest message they want to send to families looking to enjoy this creek, pick up behind you so it doesn't look like this again. Hopefully. This will also kind of talk everybody into bringing a trash bag down there with them or even some Walmart sacks or something to help get this area cleaned up. Recycle Celine will be out here tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. They're asking any volunteers that are willing to help out to join them. Reporting in Celine County, I'm Stephanie Sharp.